Whether I loved you, who shall say? Whether I drifted down your way In the endless river of chance and change, And you woke the strange, unknown longings That have no names, But burn us all in their hidden flames, Who shall say? Life is a strange and a wayward thing, We heard the bells of the temples ring, The married children, in passing, sing. The month of marriage, the month of spring, Was full of the breath of sunburnt flowers That bloom in a fiercer light than ours, And, under a sky more fiercely blue, I came to you. You told me tales of your vivid life Where death was cruel and danger rife, Of deep, dark forests, of poisoned trees, Of pains and passions that scorch and freeze, Of southern noontides and eastern nights, Where love grew frantic with strange delights, While men were slaying and maidens danced, Till I, who listened, lay still, entranced then swift as a swallow heading south i kissed your mouth one night when the plains were bathed in blood from sunset light in a crimson flood we wandered under the young teak trees whose branches wind in the light night breeze you led me down to the water's brink the spring where the panthers come to drink at night. There is always water here, be the season never so parched and sear. Have we souls of beasts in the forms of men? I fain would have tasted your lifeblood then. The night fell swiftly, this sudden land can never lend us a twilight strand, twixt the daylight shore and the ocean night but takes, as it gives, at once the light. We laid us down on the steep hillside while far below us wild peacocks cried, and we sometimes heard in the sunburnt grass the stealthy steps of the jungle pass. We listened, knew not whether they went on love or hunger the more intent. And under your kisses I hardly knew Whether I loved or hated you. But your words were flame and your kisses fire, And who shall resist a strong desire? Not I, whose life is a broken boat On a sea of passions, adrift, afloat. And, whether I came in love or hate, that I came to you was written by fate In every hue of the blood-red sky, In every tone of the peacock's cry, While every gust of the jungle night Was fanning the flame you had set alight. For these things have power to stir the blood And compel us all to their own chance mood. And to love or not we are no more free than a ripple to rise and leave the sea. We are ever and always slaves of these, of the suns that scorch and the winds that freeze, of the faint sweet scents of the sultry air, of the half-heard howl from the far-off lair. These chance things master us ever, compel to the heights of heaven, the depths of hell, whether I love you, you do not ask, nor waste yourself on the thankless task. I give your kisses at least return, what matter whether they freeze or burn? I feel the strength of your fervent arms, what matter whether it heals or harms? You are wise, you take what the gods have sent. You ask no questions, but rest content. So I am with you to take your kiss, And perhaps I value you more for this. For this is wisdom, to love, to live, To take what fate or the gods may give, 
to ask no question to make no prayer to kiss the lips and caress the hair speed passion's ebb as you greet its flow to have to hold and in time let go and this is our wisdom we rest together on the great lone hills in the storm-filled weather and watch the skies as they pale and burn the golden stars in their orbits turn while love is with us and time and peace and life has nothing to give but these but whether you love me who shall say or whether you drifting down my way in the great sad river of chance and change with your looks so weary and words so strange lit my soul from some hidden flame to a passionate longing without a name who shall say not i who am but a broken boat content for a while to drift afloat in the little noontide of love's delights between two nights end of poem